Hey, what's up? Welcome back to South 10 Beer Reviews. I am Tyler. Thank you so much for stopping by. Tonight we've got our beer review. This one comes from Electric Brewing, and this is going to be Chapters of Repugnance. I don't know if I'm saying that word right, but um, really cool label on this one. Uh, Electric is out of California, right? Da, 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 da. Brewed and packaged by 12%. So, okay, they got somebody... Um, Brewing this for them on the East Coast, it looks like. So, I think Electric is in California, though, the main uh, brewing. So, anyway, yeah, this is a double dry hopped India Pale Ale with milk sugar, and it's 7.9%. Get this thing poured. And I think I'm going to try something different. I think while I'm doing reviews, I'm just going to use a little, like, taster glass. Um, I don't know. Just trying something different. Let me just get this whole thing poured. We'll kind of swirl it a little bit. Make sure it's... All right. So, um, yeah, appearance-wise, yeah, it looks like a pretty typical uh, New England-style hazy. Um, there is some sediment in there. I don't know if you can see it or not. Uh, it's got that golden... Uh, orange type of color to it, finger of soapy head, bright white in color. Looks pretty good. Let's go ahead and shove our nose in it. Yeah, uh, it smells pretty nice. Um, it's like a uh, citrusy... It almost reminds me of one of the little fruit cocktail cups with like the cherries and the peaches and the pears and but it does have a, a very noticeable citrusy type of vibe as well so if you can in your head try to think of those two things you know kind of together and that's kind of what i'm getting so yeah it's got definitely has a stone fruit sort of thing going on peach mango sort of thing i'm getting like a um i don't know like a uh like the flesh of an orange, um, a f the flesh of like, um, like, what is it? I'm just talking about like the flesh of the fruit, um, of the pear, That's not pear. Uh, this review sucks. Uh, the peach, <laughs> the flesh of a peach. Wow. Cannot believe how long it took me to get that out. Yeah. It's got this like fleshiness to it. It's like a, Almost got a little bit of a pithy sort of orange thing too. A little bit of a little bit herbaceous, but it smells pretty fruity. Um, I think it's gonna be pretty good actually. Let's go ahead and give it a shot. Cheers. Yeah, pretty tasty. Definitely a lot more citrus. Um, it's got. You know, orange, orange pithiness, orange flesh, orange zest even. A little bit of like a grapefruit, sort of like bittersweet thing. Uh, and then it kind of transitions more into the uh, slight like pineapple-y thing. Or there's like a little bit of pineapple, a little bit of like that stone fruit coming through. It's definitely on the sweeter side with having that um, lactose in there. Lactose gives it a sort of... A sort of different mouthfeel I think um, it adds like a little bit of maybe fluffiness or something like that this mouth feels somewhere on the lighter side of medium alcohol is well hidden it is sweet though it kind of rides through the whole the whole uh, palette there got a nice little bit of bitterness too that's pretty good that it has that because if it didn't have a little bit of that bitterness to balance this out this thing would be really, really sweet. Yeah, it's got a um, slight doughy sort of malt character to it. Too. A little bready, too. Yeah, it's uh, it's decent. I was kind of expecting more. Um, I know Electric, a lot of people are on the, the hype with them, or maybe they're past that now. I don't know. Uh, but anyway... This one's brewed by 12%, so, you know, I don't know. I would like to have this again. Does this have 
a date? It doesn't, I don't think. There's no date. So I don't know how fresh this is. Um, well, it says keep cold, mind the date. But I don't see a date, so hmm, hard to do that, huh? Anyway, yeah, it's tasty. Uh, I think it's not my favorite hazy uh, by any means, but uh, it's still good. I would definitely drink it again. I would give it another shot, and I would love to try more from Electric. Um, I know, I just know that that California side of the brewery is is going to be uh, where the hype is. So um, I'll definitely pick up more if I see it. So uh, as a rating, I've, I'm just going to go with a solid four. I think it's well worth that. And yeah, pick it up. See what you think if you see it around. Maybe they're going to be more widely distributed now that 12% uh, is doing it. So um, anyway, we're going to go ahead and call it that a four. If you like this video, leave a like, subscribe. We'll see you next time. Cheers.